Mobile.com. This is just a quick video showing how to connect the Chopper X PB1 uh, PB001 program box to uh, the Chopper X new 1000 series gyros. Okay, first of all, connect the gyro to your receiver as normal. And you do not need to connect the servos to the gyro yet, but um, but this one is connected already anyway. Okay, normally the only power you need is um, from your ESC or your BEC connected to the receiver. You do not need to connect any battery or um, any power source to the gyro itself or the program box as it will get the power from the receiver just like a normal servo. Okay, first of all connect the cable to the setup box. You can see these right there are four wires for the um, setup cable and you make sure the white wire right here is at the bottom of the um, it's closer to the bottom of the program box and then this end you connect it to the gyro there's only one way for this plug to fit properly if it doesn't fit don't force it turn it around and make sure it fits properly okay now that's fitted first of all turn on your transmitter oh, it's on. make sure you have the CCPM mixing off and all the travel and the mode select to helicopter mode and all the travels uh, limit set to 100% subtrim as zero. Okay, now send power to the receiver. Normally, you, it should be done by well for smaller helicopter, it will be done by the um, ESC or for the bigger ones you have a um, BEC. But for this uh, showing purpose, we just do it by a BEC. Connect it to the receiver. Do not connect it to the box, to the program box or the gyro itself because uh, everything will get power through the receiver. Okay, now it's turn on. Don't need, no need to touch anything. It will say hello loading data and then the light will start flashing. Okay, after it starts flashing you, then go into the program mode. So you have basic setup, uh, advanced menu, and then when you find the things you like to change, press enter. Then it will show you different things you can change inside. Like for example, monitor, which is quite handy to test uh, if you have all the connection right and monitor press enter and then when you move the control stick you see the value will change accordingly so that's um, the area on the elevator Oops, sorry. and that's the rudder the R, the R stand for rudder and then the C is actually the pitch this is um, a neat function so you can check everything is working properly and connected and then after you're done with one setting you just press back back to the previous menu and then back back to the basic menu so you can select different things from the setup box and as soon as you find the things you like to change and you just press enter and then you go into whatever you like there okay great thank you and have a good day